spitting hot fire here on TYT Sports Locked Out. I have no idea why I said that. Here in Culver City, California, Rick Strom with you. Today is a huge day in European footy. Why exactly? I'm sure many of you guys know the biggest name, possibly the, the most successful manager ever. Well, he is in British footballing history, footy history. Sir Alex Ferguson is retiring after 26 seasons at Old Trafford, a.k.a. Manchester United. That's probably what I should, said, should have said. Now, his accolades are astounding. Two Champions League trophies. He has won five FA Cups, 13 league titles, four league cups, 49 trophies in all with three clubs as a manager. He was even knighted by the Queen of England in 1999. The speculation was that this was going to happen since he first brought it up about 10 years ago, 11 years ago in 2001. The 2001-2002 season is when he brought it up. You know, I may retire. He decided to turn it around, and it has been success even before that and ever since he decided to come back to Manchester United. As much as people love to hate on Sir Alex Ferguson, real name Sir Alexander Chapman Ferguson, uh, born in uh, Scotland, as much heat as he takes, he has always been respected in my eyes, and he should have been respected in your eyes because he earned your respect. With the tenure that he had, he started out so rough. I believe the first four years or so, four or five years at Manchester United were so incredibly rough and shaky, like a boat out in the sea. And if you were to think about it now, with the guys that are at the helm at these big clubs, if they struggle in their first four or five years, he probably wouldn't have survived. We've seen it so many times. You know, Pep Guardiola is even taking a sabbatical because of how much has how much he's dealt with at Barcelona, building up you know, possibly they were saying the team of the century in Barcelona. So he has earned my respect. I hope that he's earned yours as well. His health has certainly declined. He's set to have hip surgery in August. He's 71 years old. He even has a pacemaker. We believe that he will be an ambassador for Manchester United, and it is believed that David Moyes of Everton, the Toffees at Goodison Park, will take over at Manchester United. Now, we may have another video following this on David Moyes possibly going. A lot of speculation was that it would be, well, yeah, Pinks' uh, uh, name was obviously brought up because of the season that he had, even though he says that he's probably going to retire. Uh, Jurgen Klopp of Borussia Dortmund was also thrown out. Jose Mourinho was thrown out. Probably Emmanuel Pellegrini, of course, at Malaga. However, uh, it appears, at least the BBC is reporting, that he will be appointed manager, David Moyes, on Thursday. So now we get into your tweets on all this matter. You guys make this show fucking amazing with the outpouring of support that we get. I get through uh, Twitter. So let's get to those really quickly. Steven Van Der Eyck, Tweet at The guy deserves a well-earned retirement. In my opinion, one of the best managers of all time. Well put, Steven. Jawad Jawad Khan, Tweet at McStrom. Sad to see him go. United will never be the same again. Best manager of all time. No one will ever be as good as him. Craig Skibbins. It looked like Siemens, man. I'm not going to lie. Craig tweets Avery Strom, greatest manager ever, period. Thomas Iani tweets Avery Strom, we all knew we all knew it was going to happen eventually, but he left on a high and will be considered as one of the best managers in football. Blues fan 1997 tweets Avery Strom, wow. Father time caught up to Sir Alex Ferguson. United without Sir Alex Ferguson, going to be a heap load of pressure on the next manager to fill the void. I completely agree. Ted Zhao, my guy Eddie, tweets at Rick Strom, should definitely be remembered as one of the greatest managers of all time. No manager has anywhere near the amount of titles he won at United. Ike, tweets at Rick Strom, best manager ever. Gigs and Skulls will retire. Rooney will leave. His de departure will be missed at Old Trafford. Andrew Brennan, tweets at Rick Strom, trying to get through as many as I can. Not a United fan by any means, but I have massive respect for Sir Alex. He's one of the best managers ever. I agree. John Knox, not Johnny Knox of the Bears, but John Knox, tweets at Rick Strom. It's going to be weird. Uh, never knew United without Sir Alex. David Moyes will do a fantastic job. I have the utmost faith in him to get United. Look, is he going to be a Sir Alex Ferguson? If that's your expectation, it simply won't be reached. He, the, what he accomplished is simply one in a million. So if you want David Moyes to get to that level, uh, wish in one hand, shit in the other, see which one fills up first. Quoting Bad Santa. Uh, but either way, what do you guys think about all this? Let us know your thoughts. Leave a thought in the comments. Give us a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate that. And most of all, subscribe to TYT Sports.